In a bid to alleviate the urea water solution supply bottleneck, the South Korean government is in emergency mode to manage supply and demand of the fluid that's essential to keep diesel-powered vehicles on the move. It includes a cap on purchases as well as requiring sellers and producers to submit daily reports. Kim Sangmin with the details. Starting Thursday, diesel vehicle drivers in South Korea can only buy up to 10 liters of urea water solution at once. For trucks and larger vehicles that require much more of the fluid, the amount rises to 30 liters. This is because the South Korean government is taking the wheel to manage the supply and demand of urea solution, a vital fluid used in diesel vehicles that has recently seen an extreme shortage in supply. The announcement was made jointly by the country's trade ministry and environment ministry on Thursday and took effect immediately. Now with the plan, purchases can only be made at gas stations and reselling to a third party is banned. The measure also includes orders to importers, manufacturers and distributors on how to produce, supply and sell urea and urea solution. They have to report daily sales, the amount produced and stock every day by noon. To manage risks in advance, importers have to additionally report the amount they expect to import for the next two months. At the same time, exports of the materials are banned. These measures are effective until the end of this year. Also on the same day during the cabinet meeting, Prime Minister Kim bu said the government aims to lower tariffs on urea imports from now on in a bid to diversify import channels. He also stressed the need for an overall review of other key materials to prevent a similar situation in the future. To all related ministries, please proceed with a review on other materials that are heavily dependent on importation from specific countries and come up with fundamental measures. This aligns with the advice given by experts to find a solution by looking at the root cause of the problem. For example, when China started having issues in importing coal from Australia, we could have analyzed what materials are produced from coal. Coal produces lots of ammonia, essential for urea production. It's important to prevent a situation like this moving forward. As of now, South Korea has been able to secure up to four months' worth of supply of urea water solution from both inside and outside of the country, seemingly alleviating the immediate crisis. Kim Sung-min, Arirang News.